Hey everybody, my name is Hong Nguyen and welcome to Golden Nugget Book Review. Golden Nugget Book Review, sorry, I stumbled on my words there. So, if you're new to the channel, thank you very much for joining. What I do here at this ch in this channel is that I read books, non-fiction books, and I extract a golden nugget that I think are, will be beneficial, will be useful to you, and then I share it with you guys in a video under five minutes. So these videos I make daily, so hopefully uh, you guys like the video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, click on the notification button. So let's dive in. Today's book, once again, it's not the first time I extract a golden nugget from this book, but there are so many. So today's book, Will Durant's the greatest minds and ideas of all time. So Will Durant, for you guys who don't know, is a very, very famous and world-renowned historian and philosopher, American. So in this book today, the golden nugget is about morality. So are we better off? Are we better off today than we were in the past? Are we more uh, moral as you know, as a as a species, right? So the the author says yes. And I just want to read to you guys because I think I can't really put it in better words. So here we go. We think there is more violence in the world than before. But in truth, there are only more newspapers. All right? Now I'm going to skip down a little bit. We conclude that half the world is killing the other half and that a large proportion of the remainder are committing suicide. But in the streets, in our homes, in public assemblies, in a thousand vehicles of transportation, we are astonished to find no murderers, no suicides, but rather a blunt democratic courtesy and an unpretentious chivalry a hundred times more real than when men mouthed chivalric phrases, enslaved their women, and ensued the fidelity of their wives with irons while they fought for Christ in the Holy Land. There is less brutality and once again, I'm skipping ahead here. There is less brutality between men and women, between parents and children, between teachers and purple, uh, purples, purples, sorry, and in any recorded generation of the past. So, what's the takeaway here? Well, I'll paraphrase what he just said there, but I think it was very clear, but I'll put it into my own words. And the way I see this is that we're much better off, much better off than we were before as a civilization, morally, ethically. And I mean, it might seem like the world, if you listen to the news too much, you kind of get the impression that everything, the world is going to hell in a handbasket. But it's not the case. Like, it's just that because there's more newspapers, well, never mind newspapers, not at this point with the information age, with all the internet, we're bombarded, bombarded with news, information, stuff like that. So you you look really, you really look, if you look around the news, right? Like you think that wow, things are terrible, things are terrible, and and you know like hell's coming and blah 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 blah, Armageddon, whatever. But then take a look around you, and okay, well for most people, like me, if I, if I wake up in the morning. I don't know. Nobody died. Nobody jumped out the uh, the tenth floor uh, the tenth floor balcony. You know, uh, I don't I don't see any anything going on in the street. There's no, you know. So really, I think what it is is that we have to focus a little bit less. I would dare to venture a lot less on the news, right? And just what's going on around us. Not to say that it's not important what's going on uh, in the past twenty four hours. But you have to keep that into perspective. Like if you look at history and you have, that's why I find studying history so important because you have historical perspective. And by having historical perspective, you can really understand what's going on and you have a better understanding of what's going on. And then you're not stressing about it because there's, a, there's so many good things. It's just that when it comes to news, you know, bad news seems to be better than, you know, more entertaining than, than good news, right? So I just want to leave with you guys with that. That's the golden nugget. That's the way I interpreted what he said. And I hope you guys enjoyed that. So like, comment, subscribe, share this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. So four minutes and 40 something seconds and done.